Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to another episode of Autonaton. And um last episode, let's go upstairs. Get a good view. Last episode we made the Woot factory. That's it there. Um, as you can see, I did a bit of interior decorating around my um, enchanting table. And um, put in some glass, decorative glass, put in the glass. They don't have any double doors, so I just put a lot of glass there and an archway. But we had lots of trouble with the with the Woot factory. And then after I had finished, I discovered I need a power cell, an importer and an exporter to get it all started. So that's what we're going to do today. And as you can see, it's night time. I'm going to go and sleep. So at least then we can, you know, get some stuff done. Um, I don't think I did anything else. I did some... I did some mining. I did lots of mining, actually. I went down in the basement. I know we have the mining dimension, but um, I don't know. It's just easier to go down to the, into the basement and mine. So that's really what I've been doing. So, oh, where's the, where's the zombies? Is he right outside? Should we go kill some zombies? I can hear it. I don't know where it's gone. I don't know where the zombie is. I heard it. You heard it, I'm guessing. Mm, no zombie. I don't know where he is. Right, let's go and sleep and let's start this episode properly. There are monsters nearby. Where are they? According to this, is he on the roof? Is he in the house? What class is what is classed as nearby? Um, not up here. There's a creeper. According to the mini map, there is a zombie maybe on the property i'm right on top of it wherever it is maybe it's under the house again although i'm pretty sure i lit up that hidey hole under the house it's not going to be down there because it's too close i have no idea what the zombie is it says it's this way it's not in the house Yeah. Around the side of the house, maybe? Oh, there he is. There you go. We found the zombie. It says it's daytime. It's probably too late to sleep. Okay, well, anyhow, that doesn't matter. Let us go outside. Are there any... Um, on the mini-map, it looks like the creepers are all gone. Yeah, it looks like the creepers are all gone, which is fine. So, in preparation for putting the stuff under the, the boot factory, I just made some steps going down with the ramps from the platformer mod and put a block so I know where to put it and then let's go and um, make our stuff so let me see my woot stuff is here and now I need the copper because I want to make a chest 
do I have? That's dirt. Jungle wood. I also did lots of exploring. I, I went back to the desert and got lots of sand. And um, I just went out and about a bit. Where are my, my stuff? That's there. But other than that, it was mostly mining, to be honest. Okay. Now we want birch chest. Uh, I would like to make a diamond chest. To make the diamond chest, I need a gold chest. To make the gold chest, I need an iron chest or a silver chest. And the iron chest is just iron around a normal chest. Okay, so shift click that in, that's the iron chest. And then to make a gold chest. And then to make the diamond chest, I need two diamonds and six, six, six um, blocks of glass. Six blocks of glass and two diamonds. And then the diamond chest, that is what I'm going to put under the Woot factory. So now let's type at Woot and we need the power cell. So that is a power core, a factory base and a block of redstone. All right, the block of redstone, you might as well get like three blocks of redstone because I suspect I'm going to need it. And what was the other thing? Uh, basic power cell. We need a power core, which is a block of coal and a Stygian iron plate. And we can do this in our personal inventory. A Stygian iron plate, die core. Throw the iron plate, throw that, and right click. There we go. Nope, that. That's a power cell the importer and the exporter. And that is a factory base, a chest, a bucket, and a hopper. We can do all of those things. So that's that. And then we have all of those things, and that's the importer. And then the export, no, it's space. We need a space. The exporter, we need a bucket. Awesome. Right, so we need to, is it daytime? Yes it is. Nothing on the mini-map. No zombies trying to kill us. No creepers trying to blow us up. We need to go under here. Put that out the way. Factory heart, I believe. It goes under the factory heart. And... We need the power cell first. Then the importer, let's back up a little bit. And then the exporter, that should validate it. I think that's it. I think we have it. There's no more spaces and stuff. And then we need to hook up some power. All right, if we get, I think I'm going to put a windmill right here. I'll put a windmill here and get that. Let me see. If I put it, hmm. If I cut this bit down a little bit. Because eventually, like I said, I want to put the water wheel up here and let that power everything up here. Or actually, because we have that windmill producing power and not a lot of things are being powered. We've only got the furnace and the cloche that are being powered by that windmill. So what I could do then is that where is the power cell that's the exporter ah oh, that was the that was a torch i put under there to stop things from spawning 
Where are we? Where is the... Oh, the power cell is up. How do we hook up power to it? Uh, I don't know. Did I do this right? I think I did. Or maybe I should have come down one. Although that makes no sense. All right, let's have... Yeah, no, that was right because when I did that, when I took it all apart, it the spaces came apart. All right, that's the exporter, the importer. Yeah, that's that's validated. All right, I think I um let's have a look at the manual. No, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, I made lots of enchanted books. That was the other thing. I've done lots of enchanting. Woot guide. Because I made a silk touch diamond axe. Axe? That's not an axe. That's a pickaxe. Okay. But how to build power cells. The power cells power the factory and where you connect any power cables. Power cables will only connect when the factory is fully formed. Yeah, this, it has a guide, but the guide isn't, it's not all that brilliant. Because even though I've looked at videos and it said to put it under there and I've done that, but now I'm not quite sure where to connect the power to, unless I, I approach it from the top, maybe? Okay, state on, sneak for more info. Okay, but where do you connect the power to? Because if that's showing that, that means then yeah, we have... It's working, but I just don't know where to connect the power. How bizarre. All right, let's get a, a battery, a, can, a capacitor. All right, we have that, don't we? Uh, is it in my inventory? I heard it plop. No. Where'd you go? Oh, there. Is it in now? Yes, it is. And let's dig a bit of a channel down here. But where would you put it? I'm assuming you'd have to connect to the power cell. Maybe I've hooked it up wrong. I feel like it's staring me in the face and I'm missing something blindingly obvious. All right, if, let's do a little experiment. Let's take this off, but now it's no longer validated. Yep, that isn't saying anything, okay. But then if I do, I, I really don't know. I'm going to have to go and, and do a little bit of research and come back. Okay, I went and had a look and I had put the power cell block a block too high. So that seems to be, like I said, I knew I was missing something blindingly obvious, but I wasn't 100% what it was. And I wasn't sure that if I didn't put it under the, under the factory, if it would actually work. So I've changed that. I just need, it was night time, so I went and slept. And I just need to, um, let's put a light in this wall. Put that there, there you go. Do we have everything? There's still creepers out there. I don't want any creepers out there to go and blow me up because if they blow up that factory, I would be very upset. All right, there's no creepers out here. Well, there are, but they're kind of far on the mini map. So, okay, so I've put this one block down. So there's an empty space between the power cell and the factory heart above it. And if I go back on top here, it's still it's it's validated because there's no more spaces in between here so hopefully 
that's that so let's create a channel this way and I really thought I had been you know um, proactive this week and I watched the videos and I made sure I had everything but obviously not proactive enough there's still Woot is still a bit of a less output we need the thing um, it's not a crescent hammer oh dear there's too many mods engineer's hammer this should probably go up against I should go up against it see I am pretty much the most non-technical person ever so this pack is perfect for me because it's challenging me right, if we put that up against there that is output input why relay we don't want the relay we want the connector put that there actually has that transferred any power no Oh, I probably need the lever to turn it on and off. I don't know. I'm guessing. Let's carve a channel out here too. Okay. Let's get you some power. So, no, that's a relay. We want the copper wire. Move, dog. Thank you. Connected from there to... there at least you don't get um you don't get electrocuted anymore from the wires all right if i need a if i need a lever where would oh wrong thing where would i put the lever oh that power thing has just really thrown me because i because after last week i went and had a look and then realized oh we haven't finished we need the power stuff so I was thinking, yep, I'm going to leave it to the strict to the to the episode this week, and we'll do it together in the episode, and it will all be fine. But no, it's not. I'm going to have to make some more ramps, stairs to go this way. Okay, let's go here, and we want a stick. And that, that makes a lever. We'll put the lever on this side. On. No RF. Sneak for more info. Um, do I need to put into in? Do I need to put it into a battery? Is there some kind of converter? All right. Let's take this off for a second oh that side is input well no, no wonder it's it's not going to work if both sides are input that's output and there's the other side um come down and that side is input right but i mean i make these mistakes so then you don't have to when you play your game There we go, we got it. It's going in. It's going in. We did it. We did it. All right, and then this is the exporter. So I need to put our trunk there. There's nothing in it. That's awesome. So, how do you know? How do you know if it's working? Off. No, on. Oh, 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 okay. On. Yes, it's working. Look at that, it's working. Wow. Okay, spawning. Okay, so that means it should have... 
Oh, and then it refills all the... Oh, okay, we can see it there. So that 40, 47% should be spawning. Yep, that's it. But it's really draining our power. All right, let's go and have a look. Yes, it's working. Oh, this is awesome. This is absolutely awesome. Because, um, yeah, for me, Woot is one of those things where it's like, yeah, that's too complicated. It's too technical. I can't get it done. And we have a Woot factory going. I mean, yeah, I know it's just cows. But it is, it's, wow. I got it working. And, okay. It's probably pulled all of our power. I'm going to have to leave this this piece of mud here. Yeah, it is draining all of our power. So we can turn it off. Yeah, because we don't need it on all the time. But it's working. I've made it. That that is an awesome thing. I'm I'm so happy I got it to work. Well, look at that. I mean, I'm going to have to make out here a little bit prettier. I might just level this all off, actually. But I will do that between... Okay, so... Let's see. Quest book. Oh, tier 2 farm. Tier 1 is complete. Rate one upgrade. Okay, I don't know if I will go. Is this saying it's complete again? Yeah, this is this is broken. I don't know if I'm going to go into the other bits because Mom, well, we don't really need to. I mean I don't really want to. It's just for me it's a bit finicky for what you what you want to do. But I've done the first part, which is fine. I'm not really a completionist, so I'm not going to do all of it because I need to, because I have to complete it. But I will, I'll see. Because the thing is, I would really like it to be produced in Enderman, because I, I think I mentioned this in an earlier episode. It's, it's really buggy when it comes, at least in my game, it's buggy when it comes to Enderman because there's been one that's been zipping around here and I actually confronted one head on. I looked at it and it should have aggroed and come towards me and it didn't. And then I went over to it and I was fighting it. I killed it and nothing. And I've been killing, I've been killing creepers. It hasn't registered in the book. So, yeah. So at least I've done Woot. I can say that, you know, we've done it. And we've made those things. But I don't think I'll be making the other tiers. So there's that. And what is the next thing? Also, I've noticed we've got three things to do here on the front page before it's finished. I mean, this is just to update the pack. It keeps saying I have unclaimed rewards, but there's nothing to claim. Um, the weirding gadget. In order to make that, I need ender pearls. I need one one ender pearl. I don't think I have any. Oh, I do. Okay. I need an eye of ender. Oh, that's why I didn't do it, because I need an eye of ender, and I didn't have any blaze powder. But I have blaze powder now, because we've got our blaze farm. Okay, let's do this quick then. Do I only need one blaze powder? Oh, I only need one. There you go. Eye of ender, and what's that? Blocks of gold and iron. Oh, we've got plenty of gold. Well, there was me thinking I needed lots of, of, um, of ender pearls. But even so, I really don't have a lot of ender pearls. I've not been seeing any endermen. There's been none down in the mob farm. And even to to get the woot farm producing, en producing endermen drops, 
I need to kill an Enderman, and I haven't been seeing them to kill them. So that's a bit of a, a shame. Let's do the weirding gadget. That's that. And we can put that... Let's put that here. Uh, there's stuff outside, but let's quickly put that here. Right, so that's that. So that will always be chunk loaded. And we'll pick the middle loot chest, because we can. Uh, hopper upgrades. Hopper pipe, hopper filter, or filter hopper, and item faucet. Something tells me we will need a lot of iron. Hello, doggo. Um, no, that's lead. Okay, let's do this. Hopper pipe. Hopper filter. Oh, we need a redstone comparator. Okay. But I have to admit, I am quite pleased with today's episode. Even if we did have a bit of a, oh my god, what on earth am I doing? Because it's not working. But we figured it out in the end. String. Need string. We did figure it out in the end, and we got it working. Another hopper. Okay, so that's the hopper filter. Okay, that's that. Update. Good, good. Oh, choice reward. Well, hopper pipes and hopper filter is not going to do. We'll get the loot chest. And the final thing, where was that village? We need a warp stone. So what do we need for a warp stone? Ah, ender pearls. See, I haven't even come across any ender dust. Is that going to tell me mob drops from an enderman? Am I going to get this? Does this have the all the all stuff where it tells you where it falls? And uh, that makes that probably made no sense to you. It made no sense to me as I said it. But um, there is some mod packs as uses. Some mod packs will have, um, they will tell you which level ores generate on. I don't know what mod puts that in, but I haven't been finding any ender dust either. Ender dust? That's in a quartz grindstone. Oh, quartz grindstone, we could have used that for, we can use that for, for ore doubling as well. Crusher. Okay, I think what I'm going to have to do is go to the mining dimension and see if I can find anything. Okay, this is my little mining hole. Did I go down to bedrock on this? I don't know if I did. I can't remember. I got down to 17. Oh, I didn't. Oh, I did finish. And then... Oh, yes, that's right. I did shore it up with... um with wood. For a minute I thought I found an abandoned mine shaft. Ouch. Yes, I did come down this far. Alright, let's go get some torches. But I don't want to finish this episode without finishing off this last, this one last thing. All we need is four ender pearls. So either we find ender dust, or we kill endermen. And I haven't found any endermen. If I go down to Y level 30... Right, let's go this way. Okay, let's check our excavation shape. 5x5. Five five. No. None. 1x1, one 3x3. One, three three. There we go. And we need torches so we can all see what's going on. But yeah, there's nothing to say 
which level is good for finding ender dust if it's a higher level a lower level and it's really annoying or maybe what i should do is make my my mob farm just a bit taller and see if that makes a difference maybe my mob farm isn't tall enough that should be tall enough but we'll make it taller okay let us oh hello doggos i didn't i just forgot you are out and let's take off this top oh, these are all oh these are all um slabs anyway so nothing can spawn up here all right let's go up one more is that a s that's a slab as well okay so we've gone up two if i press f7 that should be sport yes that's spawnable i can just about see that but if that's spawnable because it could be that i had just done it half half a slab too low so that enderman couldn't spawn in there because i wasn't getting any enderman at all okay i'm back and as I stopped recording and I went looking for stuff, came back, the mob farm had generated an enderman. So I killed him and we ended up with two pearls. Exactly what we needed. So let's make that stone and let's finish off the tab. Warp stone. We need four ender pearls, purple dye and an emerald. And you get purple dye. Warpstone. And we get two waystones. It's claim. And we have finished the first tab. Let's make your first day a good day. All this was first day stuff, and it's taken me what? <laughs> I don't know how many episodes. <laughs> So we've done that. That is awesome. And now I can finally finish this episode. So thanks for watching, guys. Please like and subscribe. It will really help to grow my channel. And I will see you in the next episode. Okay, bye-bye.